<laughs> Welcome back, everybody. How many internet tabs is too many to keep open on your browser? 5, 10, 15? What about 458? Because that's how many our producer, Bridget Howard, currently has open on the Google Chrome browser on her phone. So, Bridget, what do you... What does that say? I'm uncomfortable. I am uncomfortable. That is what she has to say for herself. Because you don't want to get rid of these? <sighs> it was... A, see, okay, this started because of a conversation between Noah and I where he saw on my phone how many that I had. And he yelled at me. It was like, I got to delete some of these. And he started deleting them over my shoulder. And it made me break out in hives. So okay. we're going to see how this goes. Well, Bridget, so you're an electronic hoarder, essentially. Yes. Okay. Well, mm. this is a problem, and you know it, because your phone can't operate efficiently with all these tabs you've got open. Mm. It's trying to process too much information. Yes. So it's uh, time for us to try to help Bridget get a handle on this situation. It's tab closing time. We each have a vote to decide. She's going to tell us a certain tab, and then we have to say you got to get rid of it or stay. But before we begin, I was given this whiteboard, and it says, highly, the results are in. Call us hastily. Dr. Urologist. Mm. So... Um, okay. Could get on I that. know what I know what that's about. You, do you? Yeah, <laughs> I got I got back back problems. Anyway, go ahead. No, no, just saying down my back. Uh, our first tab up for grabs is a curious Google search about a curious little creature. Should this Tasmanian devil tab stay or go? So, okay, so you have a tab open about a Tasmanian devil. Yeah. I'm, I'm, um, I'm why? Oh, um, I just I thought why. about how cute they were one day, so I looked it up. <laughs> and why it don't you want to delete the tab? You've go. got the info, say goodbye. Get rid goodbye. of that, Bridget. Get rid of that. I say go as it's well. It's there if you want to see it. Go, I'll delete it. Good, okay. All right, good. Because I want to know the rationale of hanging on to it. I mean, I just would like look at it sometimes and be like, oh. All right, uh, this 1999 Kirsten Dunst oh. film was directed by Michael Patrick Jan, grossed oh, yeah. over $10 million at the box office. And now that we know, why would we need this IMDb tab for Drop Dead Gorgeous, which I love that movie. Great film, but Bridget, so good. I feel like I would like it, but I've never got to watch it. Well, I'll remind you, Bridget, so I'm here to do that for you, so go. Get rid of that, Bridget. I agree. It's got to go. Okay, you all outvoted me. Oh, you're saying keep. Yeah, Bridget, you just put it. it on your... Bridget, no, I, well, you and I, I, I watch it. I have to remind you for stuff, Lee. How are you going to remind me? Because I, I know that movie really well. I'll make you watch it one day. Our next tab is a box score for a basketball game that happened nearly a year ago. Is this worth keeping? Bridget, explain why you, you've kept this tab. Uh, I just forgot that I had it open. Uh, okay, so I think that, we're all Bridget, in agreement. We're saying go. That's a hard pass. Yeah. Delete. Yeah, okay, good. Excellent. Okay. This is like a telethon. We're going to be here all day. We with are. 456. Yeah, guys, settle in. We're doing each and every one of them. Okay, vacation season is coming to an end. So it's hard to imagine why someone would want to keep a tab open for Miami Airbnbs. Uh, okay, here's what I'm saying. I'm saying go because she went the. She went to Florida not that long ago, so that was her vacation. When she wants to plan a new one, she can start looking for other places. Go. Get rid of that, Bridget. I said keep. <laughs> Why keep? I love Miami, and I'm like, if she keeps it open, maybe we can plan a trip there. I would love to go. Yeah, it encourages me to have something to look forward to. Oh, me to. too. I, I've always got to have another trip planned. As soon as a trip I go on is over, I'm already planning the next one. Dirty martini. Hmm, how about a dirty pickle? Should we let this classic guy fieri concoction stick around? Did you, you looked this up because you heard about it and then thought I might want to make this one day? Oh, uh, we made martinis on the show, but I'm not really big into martinis, but I really like pickle juice, so I decided to try that. So it wasn't very good. You did make it? Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, then you've already done it. So Get rid I of it. I had written keep because I love a martini, but now I changed it to go. Because if you've already made it. I don't think I made it very well, but I made it. I'm intrigued. Make us one here at the office. There's 450 more to go. Here Next, we go. Next, what's our verdict on this tab for an eggplant house paint? Okay, get rid of that, Bridget. You're not in the middle of a project right now. Get rid of it. So I'm saying go. Get rid of that, Bridget. I'm saying go as well. 
I said keep because I haven't painted that room yet. Okay, you've changed. You were writing keep or delete, and you just wrote <laughs> yes this time. She's trying to confuse us. Get rid of it, Bridget. Uh, how many of these top ten books set in Ireland do we think Bridget has read? More importantly, is it worth keeping this tab open? Ooh, okay. It's... Uh, you know, here's, here's it's one of my favorite places in the world, and I eventually want to read books. All about right, I'll it. let you keep that one. Me too. Keep it. Keep because that's something you can reference back to once you've read one book. Then you go back and you read the other book. What about these colorful hair tinsels? Should they stay or should they go? Uh. Go. So I got them <laughs> open because. I saw some people were doing it again the other day, and I remember people having those as a kid, and I want them, but apparently they make your hair fall out. But I like to still look at them, Doesn't so I put question mark. Doesn't matter. You, so you just, you just want to look at All right, them. We'll do one more just before like we go to a break. Continuing with the pickle theme, should we get rid of this search for an all-pickle food diet? <laughs> oh, my God. It's an all pickled diet. I, well, not just pickles, all pickled food. So pickled bologna, pickled broccoli, pickled cloth, oh. cauliflower, all that stuff. Yeah. All right, Bridget. I'm saying get rid of that. I'm that, saying that, keep. No. I love everything pickled, but I'm saying go as well. I think it would be even funny Bridget, for the you show. Don't need that. If what I if we have to eat all? That? It's not I healthy, Bridget. I, that doesn't sound healthy. Uh, all but right. it says you could get a slim and tidy waist.